Brian, kicking things off with you with this rally underway uh, for the Dow, off better than 300 after yesterday's sell-off of better than 400. All three major indices closed lower yesterday with the Dow down better than 400, and now we have this bounce back this morning. What do you make of this volatility? Well, I think first off, you know, obviously we've had this Omicron variant that's been skittish for the markets. We've seen central banks around the world basically changing their tune about how they're going to handle monetary policy, right, with interest rates going up. Bank of England has already raised their interest rates. So I can see where things are jittery here. But I would mention here what's really remarkable is just how negative and how pessimistic investors are across the board. And as we know historically, Maria, bull markets don't die on pessimism. They usually die on euphor euphoria. And if you look at money managers right now, based on a recent Bank of America survey, they have the most amount of cash since May of 2020, rather. Um, that was right after you know, we had the, the huge crash from the pandemic, and the market went on to go up 60 percent from there. And if you look at retail investors right now, they're extremely pessimistic. So, you know, with so much money sitting in cash, especially these money managers, and as we know, money managers tend to underperform over time. They're usually wrong. They usually have money out at the wrong times. Uh, my fear here is markets are up today. Markets continue to go higher here. All these managers are sitting with all this cash. They're going to be forced back into this market, which could push markets a lot higher. And I talked about this in my podcast a lot, Pain Points of Wealth, maybe one of the fastest growing podcasts in America.